All right, hi there, Lloyd from LloydMasida.com. Uh, right now it is 10.15 in the evening at around, uh, it's the 4th of March, 2014 at 10.15 in the evening. Now, I have a couple of uh, emails, uh, small emails, I'll, I'll just answer them off. One is, hi, my name is Liz and I'm quite a big fan of yours. I've watched all your videos and I'm quite inspired as well. I study in St. Mary's and I'm in year 11th, will be doing my board exams and since you're like a big role model of mine, I would like... Uh, uh, I would like it if you could do a small presentation or something that is if you do those sort of stuff in schools uh, about pressure and stuff like that. Okay, fine. Now, in answer to your question, uh, will I want to do presentations? Yes, I don't mind doing presentations. The longest presentation that I've done is seminars that I've conducted that is around for 12 hours uh, and it can go for five days or seven days at a stretch. If you want a small presentation, it can be 15 minutes, 20 minutes, one hour you name it and uh, one thing is my presentations are normally very interesting uh, quite fun and not boring I don't like boring because I don't want to put anyone to sleep and it involves a lot of uh, you know interaction and free prizes so um, well uh, you can ask me anytime now the next question I think I got it on my whatsapp and I don't know why my dog is going crazy here yeah, nice boy nice 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 okay wait let me show you my dog he, he likes to be pampered okay come on. <laughs> Okay, okay, fine. Uh, this is the no. I have two dogs. The problem is, if I get one dog, the other dog will make noise. Okay, fine. Um, I've received on WhatsApp. Um, now this one is uh, okay. The question is uh, okay. Here, here's the question. Hi there. I'm 17 years old. I'm studying in Winchester School, and my grades have been low in my exams, and all my teachers. Keep calling my parents saying that I need to be stopped. I need to be stopped from getting involved in music. I'm a musician. I've been playing music since I was the age of three. That is the only best thing I can do. Uh, so what is your advice to me? Okay, first let me get rid of my dog. Okay, come down here, down, down. Oh. Okay. Uh, all right, in, in terms of music, see, listen up. Um, I won't take your name. Uh, let's see, I'll give you a nickname. What's your name? Mr. D. Okay, Mr. D, about music. Now, l listen, having a hobby is good. Having an interest is good. Uh, but you need to be really practical in nature because, see, uh, let's let's face it. End of the day, okay, let's say you, you graduate in music. But then you need to get a job because you need to earn some money. And if you don't have money, nobody's going to look at your face. And trust me, you don't want to be like some of, uh, you know, in European countries, they have these guys who take their musical instruments, sit on the road and just put their hat and people throw in coins. They're gifted, they're talented, they're really good at what they do, but they just put their hat and they get coins. So do you want to run your life like that? Or do you want a life where you can enjoy, get some perks, uh, you know, have a little extra money, buy a car, have a nice house. And with the extra money, you can still focus on music. So if you ask me, I would say... Uh, you know, uh, having a hobby does not give you the excuse of not focusing on your career. You need to study because your parents are paying money for your school. So focus on trying to get the best marks that you can. Not saying get a rank, but get the best marks that you can. And then side by side, focus on your music. In fact, you can make a deal with your parents that if you get good marks, uh, maybe they can, you know, help you, uh, you know, pursue your hobby. But make sure, make sure that you focus on your uh, studies. There's no excuse for that, my friend. Trust me, nobody wants a dumb guy. They need a person who is intelligent and education uh, is important. Don't get me wrong. Education is important, but I'm not saying get a first rank. Understand the education and make sure that you get at least good marks, at least pass, at least, you know, get at least 50%. That's all. You know, at least take some interest. So don't ignore it. Final question. Okay, this is from Gibbon George. I've been meaning to ask you for ask you something for some time and if you don't mind I noticed all your updates start with Loy Macedo does something Loy Macedo this Loy Macedo that it always starts off with Loy Macedo do you do that for a reason it seems to place you at a level above normal human beings at least subconsciously to the reader at a higher status than others I was wondering if this is part of your personal branding strategy well you have asked me a question and uh, the answer isn't the question it is a personal branding strategy because what I want to do is I want to drive home the point that there is a brand called Loy Macedo and they need to check LoyMacedo.com. So every time I put up an update, I say Loy Macedo. Uh, so that has become my brand signature. And I'm very glad you noticed it because the fact that you notice it uh, shows that it is effective. So it's uh, a little bit of narcissism and a little bit of show off. But at the same time, it is a branding strategy 
for people to remember that um, there is a guy named Roy Macedo and this is Roy Macedo's opinion. That is why right. every photograph that I have, every update that I put, every question that I ask, anything that I do has Roy Macedo there. So this is more or less the reason why I put it. So anyway, these are the three questions that people have asked me. I hope uh, they answer your question. Uh, small questions, I'll merge it together. Big questions are answered separately. Thank you very much. Roy from RoyMacedo.com saying goodbye.